For our next video, we're going to explain the use of the Tests tab on the Settings menu of the icon. So from the startup screen, you simply press the Settings button to expose all of the Settings menus. Touch the Test tab, turning it blue to indicate you're on that tab. The first test featured is the Scanner test. This test can be used to verify which data is contained within the barcodes that you're trying to scan in your pharmacy. If you're having trouble or you're just setting up your icon for the first time, when you call the factory for assistance setting that up, we will probably have you go to this tab and scan the barcode. So you simply scan your barcode. All of the digits contained within the barcode are displayed. If you're reading them off to us, if there are any spaces or anything like that, make sure you also read those to us because it's important to know where any spaces are contained in your barcode. They're not very common, but they do occur. So. Very simple, just used to validate, validate what data is contained in with your barcode. You can press clear and scan another one. The camera test, again, we might ask you to go there if you call the factory for assistance in troubleshooting any aspect of the icon. It shows a picture of the pill tray. You can wave your hand over here, make sure it's taking a live picture, and just verify you should see that purple rectangle on the board of the screen, which shows the counting area of the pill tray. The other tests has some less commonly used features, primarily to verify the operation of the speaker, as well as to calibrate the touch screen. So if you're using the icon and you go to touch a button and it does the cursor does not point to where you touched, then you probably need to calibrate your touch screen. That doesn't need to be done in the field very often, but if it does, you simply go to that menu and press the calibrate touch screen and then touch the screen at the center of the five crosshairs that will appear sequentially on board the screen. Then if you want to test it afterwards, you can press the touch screen test menu, then click the five buttons on the screen to verify that it's touching in the right spot.